Okay, we will now start and try and take an alive core EKG on this cat Colin. And the first thing I do is I try and localize the uh, point of maximum of hard sounds with my stethoscopes. And as I found that, I will then place uh, the telephone so I have the heart in the middle. And uh, uh, at this point where the front electrode will be, I will uh, divide the fur coat and put a few drops of uh, alcohol uh, on this side and then I measure for the distal electrode here and place some alcohol here and divide the fur coat then I will start the uh, telephone and the application a live core uh, and we will get an EKG screen on the telephone I will then place the telephone over the heart and uh, we will see uh, an EKG running. In this case we have uh, a setting of recording for 30 seconds. And we can here also see the heart rate of the cat. When uh, this is uh, finished, I can press uh, this button and I can uh, put in the name of the cat. Uh, and I can also press here and send this recording to uh, an internet site where I later can take it down to my computer. To <coughs> further analyze this, I <coughs> can press a round button and the off and on button at the same time, which will produce a screenshot. And that's useful because I can pick it up among pictures in the camera here as the latest picture, and I can increase uh, the size of the <coughs> EKG complex. And this way, we can see the P wave and the QRS complex and it's quite easy to uh, calculate. You can see the duration here a little bit less than two millimeters but we can also calculate the amplitude as one, two, three, four, almost five, five millimeters. 